special tropical weather bulletin here at Meteor Marks Weather Northeastern. Heading right into tropical storm going on Hurricane Gaston here. Hurricane Gaston basically looking as you can see towards just off the coast of the Cape Verdes here. It is looking very well organized and should remain a hurricane through the forecast period you can see taking it just east of Bermuda by days four and five. We're basically getting into a very good environment here for Gaston to intensify into a potentially major hurricane as we enter the latter portion of the week into the weekend. So we could achieve a major hurricane status here, although it will be little to no effect across land areas. Now we're watching another system of interest here, Invest 99 here towards the Lesser Antilles, uh, moving towards Puerto Rico and eventually Haiti and the Dominican Republic. Now this system, hurricane forecast hunters basically flew through this system and they didn't find a closed circulation, but nevertheless, we'll continue to watch it here because look at the storm track of this. As this thing develops into anything, it could eventually affect the Bahamas and then eventually extreme southern Florida. So Florida wants to continue to keep an eye on this system because if something does spin up here, we could have problems. Taking a look at the satellite photo, you can see right here is Gaston. It's looking very very well defined here on satellite. Look at that outflow, looking very healthy. And then of course, Vest 99 here. This is the system to potentially watch here as it moves towards the west northwest. It will kind of skim all of the northern Caribbean islands here. So we'll continue to watch it here at Media Mark for all of your tropical weather coverage. Taking a look at, of course, your precipitation outlook across North America. It's mainly in the heartland here where we have the problems. We got that trough of low pressure back east here. Look at South Florida. Whatever Invest 99 does, if it develops into anything or not, it will still produce heavy rain totals by days four and five here in South Florida and the Keys. And then up here in the northeast, we'll have a quick system move through. Take a look at that pattern. Trough out here out west. It's on the base of this trough. We'll get those severe strong thunderstorms. Take a look at the forecast. We're starting off with your midpoint of the week, Wednesday, almost to the weekend. Look at across the northeast, wall to wall sunshine here. Temperatures making it up into the mid 80s for a popular number from the Susquehanna River Valley, Hudson River Valley, westward to the Ohio River Valley and lower Great Lakes. Your Thursday. Sharp cold front starts to develop here to the west. Moving in, we get the possibility of strong to severe thunderstorms from Erie, Pittsburgh, London, Buffalo, maybe as far east as Bradford and State College here later in the day. Temperatures warming up quite nicely. We'll have some late day showers and thunderstorms developing here across the Susquehanna region of upstate New York and Pennsylvania, Hudson River Valley and mainly from the Adirondacks on westward as well into your Friday. That system starts to push to the east. Moving across the area, you can see we still have the chance of late day thunderstorms with the most widespread part being here in New England. We see temperatures starting to cool down into the 70s here and look at this for your Saturday. Looking beautiful across the northeast, wall to wall sunshine with temperatures mainly in the upper 70s and lower 80s. In 10 seconds, I'll have a five-day outlook from my hometown viewers from Binghamton to Scranton, Upper Susquehanna region of upstate New York and northeast Pennsylvania. Don't forget to like me on Facebook at MediaMark, subscribe to me on YouTube at MediaMark.com, Twitter at WX Northeastern, Google Plus at MediaMark, also MediaMark.com and WeatherNortheastern.com. Take a look at the extended outlook here. The only day that really is a problem is your Thursday. We get the chance of late day showers and thunderstorms, especially in the evening into the overnight. It'll be over with by Friday morning. Look at that. The Saturday and Sunday, if you have the weekend off, Get out there and enjoy it. Lows in the 50s, highs in the upper 70s to lower 80s. That's going to do for this edition of Weather Northeastern.